I think one of the most interesting adaptations is a book we really don't teach in film classes anymore, and we shouldn't, because the content is awful. We don't need this story anymore, but it's an interesting demonstration in why the power of adaptations, right? Of course, I'm talking about The Klansman, which was written just after the Civil War and has to do with the rise of the Ku Klux Klan. And it makes the Ku Klux Klan the heroes which is frightening. I know, eyebrow rip over there. How could that possibly be true? Well, obviously, a former Confederate, the children of Confederates, would think of them as heroes. So this was a huge book, right? And sadly, one of the early, early uh, directors that we all know, D.W. Griffith, was also in love with the Confederacy in the South. His grandfather had been in the Confederate Army. So he undertook to make the film, which was huge. It starts out being called Klansman, but we know it now more as the birth of a nation. Again, we used to teach it in film classes because there's a lot of new camera angles and things that make it valuable, but we've come away from that because the content is just so controversial and so valueless that we don't teach it in classes anymore.